Hello beautiful people. Well tonight we are going to connect with our spirit dragon. I have a dragon's tooth here and my dragon is a crystalline diamond dragon and this is a crystalline diamond dragon's tooth. Um, it's crystalline selenite is what it is and it's a dragon's tooth from my diamond crystalline dragon so today I'm going to take you through a meditation to meet your dragon your spirit dragon now they are powerful beings they are multidimensional beings that have lived on this earth and around this earth for hundreds of years but it was hundreds of years ago that they uh, went into another dimension, if you like, when the veils came down um, because of the way humans were back then. Um, but now they are starting to not fully materialize, but we are starting to change so we can connect with our spirit dragons. They are powerful creatures. They can take you anywhere. They can protect you. They are amazing. When you connect with your spirit dragon, you can ask them for help with all sorts. So even with your house, you can ask your spirit dragon to protect you while you sleep at night, to protect your house, and they become like a guardian to you. So um, let's go for it and see so you can meet your dragon and see what your dragon is like so I'm just putting some music on so again as usual we start off with that beautiful unconditional love so I want you to take a breath in breathing in that unconditional love and breathing out and as you breathe out allowing yourself to fully relax just fully relaxing taking a beautiful deep breath in again of that unconditional love breathing it in allowing it to fill your heart space and expand your heart space and breathing out again feeling it anything that no longer serves you leaving your body breathing in again breathing in that beautiful unconditional love see it is a pink mist entering your body entering into each and every cell going down to your toes your fingertips and the top of your head filling your entire being and breathing out relaxing releasing Breathing in again, breathing in that beautiful, unconditional love. Breathing it in, seeing that pink mist flood your system, going out through your skin this time, into your energy field. So you're lying or sitting in a bubble of unconditional love. If you haven't already, closing your eyes. Feeling this space as all thought patterns leave your mind and you're focusing on breathing in unconditional love and breathing out what no longer serves you. So I want you to bring your consciousness now down into your heart space. on a journey through your heart so we're in the energy of your heart space your heart chakra and really your heart space is a portal to many dimensions it is a multi-dimensional portal to many many dimensions so with intention now we are going to connect to the realms where 
where your spirit dragon resides. So if, as your consciousness now is in your heart chakra, we are going to go deeper down into that portal, through that multidimensional portal, going deeper and deeper down into it. Like you're going down a beautiful pink or green funnel deeper and deeper and you could see that there are many doorways that go off this funnel but we're going now deeper down still going deeper and deeper and we're going to connect to the doorway that takes you to the realm of your spirit dragon So as that doorway comes up in front, we go through that archway and out the other side and into this beautiful magical space where there are clear blue skies, but in that blue there are also tones of other colours. You can see that there are unusual shaped, what look like clouds. And as you look across the land, there is the most amazing landscape before you. And it is like you've stepped into a world where Alice in Wonderland would be. You can see that there are plants and they have little faces. And you can read and feel their consciousness and what they're thinking. You can see that there are beautiful trees, ancient tree beings, beautiful rock formations and stone formations dotted across the land as you look out and over upon this landscape. And you can see for hundreds of miles into the distance. But in front of you, there is a golden path. So you're going to walk towards and down that golden path. Looking at the landscape either side, how amazing it is. Walking down further. And you can see that some very unusual plants, like you've never seen before. And the colours of this land are absolutely amazing. The ancient tree beings are speaking to you with their consciousness. You can feel it floating into your being, a frequency, a sound, a tone, words, as these ancient tree beings are talking to you. And you can hear a higher pitched language 
and you realise it's coming from the flowers that you can see dotted around. This truly is a magical place where there are magical creatures. And as you go further down this golden path, you come to a big stone cliff face. And each side of that cliff face, there is an ancient tree being, and it's like a natural castle. As you step forward between these ancient tree beings, and as you step in, you can see that there is a cave, and it is huge, and you can see that within this cave, the entrance to it is aligned with gold and diamonds. And you know that your beautiful dragon is within this cave. And you know that this is where you have to go. You can hear your dragon talking to you. And it is ethereal. It is magical. closer the tones get louder and louder you know it is a magical space you can see the gold and the diamonds reflecting the beautiful light that is shining in the cave. And as you get to the entrance and start to walk inside, you are surprised at how smooth the cave floor is. And you realize it is all clear quartz on the floor of this cave. As you look around the cave, you can see it is aligned with gemstones, all different colours. The sound of your dragon is reverberating off all of the walls. stand here and listen, the energy that comes from that sound ripples through your body like a power entering every single cell. As you look towards 
towards the back of the cave. You can see these beautiful colored eyes looking at you. They are large. This is your dragon. Look what color those eyes are. How beautiful they are. And you can sense by looking into those eyes a strength and a power, but compassion and love. And your dragon slowly starts to walk forward out of the darkness at the back of the cave. And you can see now the shape of your dragon's nostrils coming out first. You can see the dragon's breath coming out of the nostrils. And you can see that your dragon can breathe fire because there is smoke coming out of the dragon's mouth. What colour is your dragon? What is your dragon made of? Is your dragon made of gold, crystal, silver, flesh? Something you've never seen before? Stone? What is your dragon made of? As it comes out of the shadows and the darkness at the back of the cave now, you can see that it is very big and it comes towards you and you have to look up at its face. But what it does, it brings its face down towards you and gently brushes the side of your head with its face like a cat would greeting its owner. It is so happy to see you and that you have come for it. Feel its joy, feel its power. its chest and connect to the dragon's heart, blending your energy with your dragon. This connection is so strong and so powerful that your dragon will be fully connected to you only. So your dragon now bends down to allow you to climb upon its back and as you do you sit at the base of its neck and it has two horns coming out that you can hold on to and you can see from your heart to your dragon's heart, going through its back, there is a silver cord attaching you both, heart to heart. And now it is time for you to take a ride with your dragon. And your dragon walks now towards the cave entrance with you on its back. And as it gets outside into that beautiful freshness, that warmth, that blueness of the sky, it starts to run and take off and flaps its beautiful wings and 
takes you for a ride. And how does this feel for you? Feel this joyous time. Feel this freedom. As you and your dragon that you are solely connected to, heart to heart, fly through the skies. You can see as you look back, you can see the dragon's tail in the distance going up and down because that's what's helping the dragon to maneuver through the air. And the wings are flapping in a beautiful pattern. And you can see the colours and the patterns on the dragon's skin. And you can feel the joy that your dragon has now to finally fully connect with you. And your dragon now takes you on a journey. This journey you will remember as you're flying through the air. Looking down at the land, you're seeing such amazing sights. dragon might take you into space. Your dragon might take you into the oceans because your dragon can go anywhere in any dimension but especially the higher dimensions. Taking in this beautiful journey and this beautiful connection as you feel safe and secure and you are so happy that you now finally know who your spirit dragon is.
is time for your dragon to bring you back. And as your dragon flies around and back towards the cave entrance, it actually misses the cave entrance and comes back into the portal with inside your heart and comes through down that beautiful funnel of green or pink coming back within your heart within your heart chakra and your dragon is going to stay within your heart chakra but even though it is within your heart chakra it is only through the veil to this magical world where dragons now live. And you can call it upon it at any time to come in for protection, for help, no matter what's going on in your life. It is always there for you. It is powerful, strong, compassionate and loving. count to five coming back in the room one two three four and five open your eyes open your eyes back in your body welcome back So I don't know about you, but my whole head is buzzing because I really felt the energy of that. And the beautiful dragons, what a beautiful space that was. So please do this anytime. If you want to deepen that connection with your dragon, do it every day. Do this um, meditation every day for maybe the next week, maybe a bit longer really strengthen that connection with your dragon you might not need to do that but only if you feel like it and each time you'll go on a different journey with your dragon but your dragon is there for you anytime just you just need to call upon your dragon so i hope you've enjoyed this connection with your beautiful dragon spirit beautiful beautiful creatures I know that I spend time with my crystalline, golden crystalline dragon. Or maybe he's diamond, I don't know. But anyway, it's beautiful spending time with them, the beautiful creatures. So uh, if you are new to this, please, please um, subscribe and share so other people can go on this journey. And if you do subscribe and you would like to receive notifications of every time I put a video up, please click on the little bell and then you will get notifications. And please, please share with your um, pages if you're on Facebook or your family and friends. You might even want to sit down and do this with your children because it's just a beautiful, beautiful connection. Uh, for your kids to connect to their dragon spirit, their dragon spirit totem, or their dragon spirit animal, whatever you would like to call it. So it's lots and lots of love from us here in New Zealand. Please, please share. This is a beautiful, beautiful journey. And again, please share it with your children, even the younger ones, because uh, it will give them a, uh, a spirit totem to call upon if ever they're feeling frightened so lots of love from us bye for now bye